Ah, the business major. These unique individuals are characterized by their entrepreneurial spirit and the tenacity to, one day, make loads of money. There are many beliefs surrounding these students, such as becoming multi-level marketers, stock traders, or that they are just in school to get their MRS degree. We have decided to follow Brad to embark on a journey to find exactly what a day in the life of a business major is like. Is, is this thing on? Is, are, we, are we good? Are we good? Okay. Uh, what's up? My name is Brad, and I'm a business major. I haven't always been a business major. I started out in mechanical engineering my first semester and then switched to finance after that uh, to live out my Wall Street dreams. After about a half semester of that, I then switched to marketing and focused on sales. I guess you could say I'm a people person. Usually I wake up pretty early around 11 to go to my first class of the day. Well, actually it's not really my first class, but the teacher in the class before doesn't take attendance. So why would I go to that? I always have to warm my brain up with the daily wordle before I actually start paying attention. I think I'm pretty good at it. One thing I learned about going to class in business school is that on the first day, you always have to sit next to the ladies. I showed up late to this class, so the best I got was behind one. You'll never find this in any engineering class. What is that dress? I'm, I'm not a fan of the green one. She really needs to go for the red one. She'll look good in that one. After class, I usually like to go meet up with my friends. Hey guys. What's up, man? How, how we doing? doing? How was class? That was good. We actually, actually learned a lot today. Chase, how are your classes? Dude, let me tell you, my engineering classes have been absolutely brutal recently. Hi, uh, my name's Chase. I'm actually one of Brad's good friends and I'm an aerospace engineering major here. Upon graduation, I'm hoping that I can go and uh, pursue my passion of working for Lockheed Martin. I don't really know exactly what Brad does for school now. He couldn't last even one year in engineering and most of the time now when he has class, it seems like he's either skipping or asking for somebody to send the notes. You want to know how to tell if someone's an engineering major? You just tell them how hard one of your own classes are. Yeah, I feel that, dude. I bombed an HR management test last week. Dude, HR management? Are you serious? I wish I could be taking the classes that you're taking. I would easily have a 4.0. Brad, your classes are so easy. Shut, Shut up, up Gordon. Gordon. You can't say anything. Don't you have a lasagna do at midnight? Fettuccine Alfredo. So we had this test last week, right? I studied for three straight days. It's been a week since we took the test. We finally got it back today. I got a 64 on it. A 64. It was 10 questions and it took me two hours long. Do you know how frustrating that is? Every engineering major is like this. They always complain about how difficult their classes are and how hard it is, but they always get super upset when they hear someone else complain about how difficult their class is. You know, sometimes I think that we're just too hard on each other. Just because we have different strengths and choices and what we want to do with our lives post-college, it doesn't mean that we have to keep demeaning each other in the majors that we choose. Was I smart enough for engineering? Maybe. We'll never truly know. But it's not all about who's the smartest or who has the largest workload. College is about more than just classes. It's about fun, coming together and meeting people who you may have never met before to create an amazing experience that is like nothing else. We are more than just our majors. Maybe, just maybe, if we set aside all of our differences and come together, we can learn something about each other. You wanted to see me? Hey, Chase. Why don't you have a seat? 